a flow of teach yourself is brick notes this is a new concept before going to prepare we will find out what is the structure of answer that means what we have to learn prepare headings after write the brick notes we notice what the headings are there which part of heading is uh, easy to learn which part of a challenge to learn the next thing is collect and arrange things in each heading this is a new concept is based on discovery the things observe the action of things relate the things under each heading describe how to write in answer brain needs repetitions rehearsals to memorize the answer but describes the answer it treat as relevant to you it takes an action of you compare the things and finally value the it decorate the answer understand the answers is different from present the answer in examination it is necessary to get good marks for example a question is explain the formation of stationary waves in stretched strings and hence deduce the law of transverse waves in such a string the first thing is brick notes we prepare the brick notes like that first one write the definition of stationary waves describe the formation of stationary waves in such a string write the resultant wave equation and define node and anti node write the modes of vibration of stretched string this is heading only first harmonic draw the diagram write about nodes and anti nodes write the length and wave equations of first harmonic substitute wavelength value in equation second harmonic draw the diagram of second harmonic write about how many nodes and the nodes in the ha second harmonics write the length of the length and wave equations and substitute the wave wavelength value in equation third harmonics draw the diagram write about nodes and anti nodes write the length and wave equations substitute wavelength equation value in e velocity equation write the equation of frequency of vibration for n loops or p loops write the law of transverse waves in structure string this is a heading only write the definition and equation of first law write the definition and equation of second law write the definition and equation of third law once again write the definition of stationary waves describe the formation of stationary waves in a stretched string write the resultant wave equation and define nodes and anti nodes write the modes of vibration of strings this is heading only first harmonic draw the diagram of first harmonic how many nodes and anti nodes write the length of the equations and substitute wavelength value in e velocity equation 
now we find the <coughs> frequency of first harmonic second harmonic draw the diagram write about nodes and anti nodes write the length and wave length equations and substitute the wavelength in the velocity equation third harmonic draw the diagram write about nodes and anti nodes write the length wave equations substitute wavelength in velocity equation write the equation of frequency of vibrations for n mole loops law of transverse waves in structure string this is a heading write the definition and equation of first law and write the definition and equation of second law write the definition and equation of third law the next step is prepare headings stationary wave first heading is second heading is formation of stationary waves in structure string the third heading is resultant wave equation define the nodes and anti nodes modes of vibration of structure string first harmonic and another one is second harmonic third harmonic equation of frequency of vibration of n loops law of transverse waves structure string first law second law third law once again prepare the headings stationary waves formation of stationary waves in structure string resultant wave equation nodes and anti nodes mode of vibration of structure string first harmonic second harmonic third harmonic equation of frequency of vibration of n loops or p loops law of transverse waves structure string first law definition second law definition third law definition